Dear students, let's discuss intellectual property rights. Before that, what are the learning outcomes of this lecture? After attending the lecture, you will be able to understand the meaning of intellectual property and explain the types of intellectual property rights. So let's see what is intellectual property. Intellectual property refers to creation of the mind. Means intellect word, intellect word is related to brain or mind. So anything which is created by brain is intellectual property. Like inventions, literary and artistic works, symbols, names, images used, images used, they all comes to intellectual property. So this is intellectual property. Now, what are the intellectual property rights? Intellectual property rights are like any other property right, like home, car, these are the physical properties. And intellectual property is property related to brain. So intellectual property right creators or owners of the work, they get benefit from their work or investment in a creation. As we know, any creation, any invention requires lots of time, efforts and money. So whosoever spends on this, they should have a right on their property. So now let's take one example, example from a new, which says, Instagram says no to using photos without photographer's permission. So what was the need of Instagram to say no using the photos, photos without the permission of photographers? Because the photographs are intellectual property of photography. So photographer should get benefit. Let's take an another example, which is a very good and interesting example from the Bollywood movie. Bollywood movie uh, Bala. So what this cutting says, Ayushman Purana's Bala in trouble. It may face a third copyright violation case from Ujra Chaman. So now try to understand what happened here. The right hand side movie that came earlier and the Bala movie came later. The story, script writing, they all comes to intellectual property. So, other persons cannot use intellectual property without permission of owner or creator. So, this is one more example of intellectual property. So, now understand why we need to promote or protect intellectual property. Because only because of intellectual property, it allows to create and invent new works in the areas of technology and culture. It encourages the commitment of additional resources for further innovation. Means someone is innovating or inventing something and he or she is getting benefit out of them, then they will get motivated for further innovation. It may create new jobs from that creation of technology or changes in a culture, it may create new jobs, new industry and it enhances economic growth of country as well as quality and enjoyment of life. So this is advantage of promoting intellectual property. Now we have discussed that what are the benefits to the creator or the inventor. But what is the benefit to the average person from intellectual property? As we know that it reward creativity and human endeavor. But because of this creation, humankind gets benefit. Say for example, multi-billion dollar film industry. They, they entertain us. Recording industry, music industry, publishing industry, software industry. This lecture was possible because of the enhancement or innovations in a software industry. If they were not granted uh, uh, any rights or uh, their intellectual property was not granted, uh, not uh, protected, then they may discourage 
for the further invention. So that is why invention, uh, protection of intellectual property is must. Let's take another example of how the other persons get benefited, say here. Researchers and inventors, they produce better and more efficient products like medicine, vaccines and so on. Any new medicine, any new drug which is, uh, which is invented, it must get IPR, intellectual property. Right? Say for example, vaccine. If someone invents vaccine for COVID-19, then he or she should get benefit out of that because they may have spent a lot of money, effort and time on the invest. So because of IPR, consumers can confidently buy some products or services because of the, their trademark or IPR protection. So it guarantees the quality of the product. So till now, what we have discussed is what is intellectual property, what are the intellectual property rights, what is the benefit to the intellectual property right owner or creator or inventor and what are the benefits to the average person of idea. Now, what are the different types of intellectual property rights? So, we can broadly categorize them into two parts. One is industrial property and another one is copyright. Industrial property and Copyrights. Industrial property is further categorized into patents, trademarks, and industrial design and geographical indications. So, one by one, we will discuss all the types of IPR in brief. In brief. So, let's start with the copyright. What is copyright? Copyright covers literary works like novels, poems, plays, films, music, artistic works like drawings, paintings, photographs, sculptures, architectural design. It also covers performing arts in their performances, producers, phonograms in recordings, and broadcasters in their radio programs, TV programs, etc. So, copyright basically covers following things literary, musical, artistic, dramatic, recording. See in the center are artistic. This is the cartoon character Tom and Jerry. They are also protected by copyright. Copyright is the IPR. Uh, let's move to the another IPR. Another IPR is patent. Now what is patent? Patent is exclusive right granted for an invention. Invention may be product or process. It provides new way of doing something or that offers a new technical solution to a problem. So basically patents are of two types, product patent and process patent. The patent owner give, are awarded the protection to use their invention for a limited period of time and that limited period of time is 20 years. 20 years. In some of the cases, it may, uh, the patent time may extend it up to 25 years also. After that, that invention becomes public. So, anyone can use it without permission. But before that, during the patent period, they need to take a permission. Now, let's move to the another IPR that is trademark. Now, what are the trademarks? Trademarks are distinctive signs that identify certain goods or services produced or provided by an individual or a company. So it is identification mark, but identity of what? Identity of its uh, products or service uh, specific characteristic and quality. So if you see a certain trademark, you are assured that this kind of quality or this kind of characteristic product I will get. So, let's take an example of different trademarks. These are the different trademarks. Right. In the center, we have the symbol of apple. So, this apple is a trademark. 
Then Google. Google is a trademark. Burger King is a trademark. KFC is a trademark. So trademarks can be a pictorial mark like apples and all. It can be a word mark like a Google. It can be a combination of both word mark as well as pictorial mark. So by looking just at like McDonald, like McDonald, yellow color M symbol. So just by looking at that trademark, you are assured about their quality. Another IPR is industrial design. Now, what is the purpose of industrial design? Industrial design is ornamental or aesthetic aspects of an art. So here, these designs are protected but the designs are mainly created for ornamental purpose or beautification purpose. That design may consist three dimensional features such as shape, surface of an article or a two dimensional feature such as patterns, lines or color. Now the question is which articles this industrial design IPR is granted? Yes. It can be granted to almost anything. They are applied to industrial products, handicrafts, technical and medical instruments, watches, mobiles, laptops, tablets, jewelry, other luxury items, housewares, electrical appliances, vehicles, cars, bikes, architectural structures, textile designs, laser goods, etc. Let's take example of some industrial design and you will understand the better. Say for example, these are here is the chess board, fan, iPad, iPhone and chair. So this design looks beautiful, aesthetic appeal is there. Although say for example chess board, so this design is not helping in how to improve the game or how to play the game is not getting changed but it just provides the aesthetic similarly fan design chair etc so industrial designs are basically for ornamental purpose another ipr that is geographical indication now what is the use of geographical indication they are used as again identity like a trademark but here what is the difference if GI is for specific geographical origin products or goods and because of their place of origin they contain specific quality and reputation. It is common in agricultural products although it is not limited only to agricultural products but it is common for agricultural products. Why? Because agricultural products depends on specific geographical factors like climate and soil. Now climate and soil in Jammu Kashmir is different than the climate and soil in a country. From Gujarat to West Bengal, they are different. So the products which are generated or grown in that region will have a specific quality, specific characteristic. Say for example, these are the example of geographical indications. Kolhapuri Chapel. This is a specific reason of Maharashtra producing this kind of So it is a quality characteristic of that reason. Sahi Lichi of Bihar. Climate and soil is different in Bihar. And that is why it producing this quality characteristic containing each. Similarly, Alphonse is a characteristic of Ratnagari district of Maharashtra. Touch embroidery from Gujarat, Pasmati rice from many places of India. So, these are the geographical indications. Now, what we discussed till now what is intellectual property? Property related to mind or created by the mind. What are the intellectual property rights? The rights because of intellectual property. What are the types of intellectual property rights, copyrights, patents, trademarks, industrial design and geographical indicates. So this was all about intellectual property right in India. Okay. Thank you.